Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day, my beautiful brother. Happy Valentine's Day, my beautiful sister. Thank you for sharing your space with me as I share the thought massage, the vibe, and the reflection and key with you. All right, uh, getting started and moving right along. Today, uh, the vibration is infinity. It is infinity. Actually, the vibe is uh, success and efficiency. It is the number eight, and that represents, that is the vibe for success and efficiency. However, when I woke up, when I first woke up this morning, I thought of that, but then I thought infinity. And I thought, oh, wow, this is so cool. Today is Valentine's Day. This is the month of love and affection, self-expression. Today uh, is success and efficiency, but we're going to make it personal here. Usually that vibe is like for material, business, different things like that. But we're going to make it personal this morning for today's vibe and, and thought massage and reflection, okay? The infinity, the infinity symbol. You know, the infinity symbol is simply the eight sideways. That is the infinity symbol. And today, today is a beautiful day. Today is a beautiful day to... Build on relationships that are lasting, okay, that have become lasting, more personal and inside, internal. Today is a wonderful day to, to recognize lastingly from here on in, lasting infinity, that you are worthy. Yes, you are worthy to receive. Yes, you have absolutely what it takes. Yes, and yes, you deserve the very best. Okay, we're going to decree, affirm, declare, and acclaim. We are worthy to receive the very best. We have absolutely what it takes to have the very best. And we deserve the very best. All right? All right. So infinity today. Today is a good day to begin doing that. And now also, um, and in doing that, guys, and in doing that, what do we do? We tap into ourselves. And the other day, the other day, um, I received, I always say I received from the universe. I received from God. I received and it makes so much sense that there is a part of you inside the heart of you. And that part of you is all-knowing, is all-wise, yet it is pure innocence. That part, and, I, and it was a lot of things that went into it that I wrote down, I recorded it because as things came, I recorded it, wrote it down. Um, but the essence is that part of you that is inside the heart of you, that's the true self. That is the connection, that touching connection, that mother, father, daughter, son energy connection with God, the creator, that part of you that's inside the heart of you, that isn't influenced by the world and our personal world and the other worlds that people bring to us, that part of us is not influenced or affected by that. That part is in the world, but it's not of it. It's not of it. So that's the vibe for today. Uh, the vibe for today, infinity, beginning to lastingly know and connect with the part of us. <laughs> I love that. That is inside the heart of us and which is essentially our true self. 
people, uh, there's a new, well, not necessarily new, but there's a phrase now, the authentic, uh, the authentic self, the same thing, uh, our true self, our higher self, um, that's the part. So let's infinity that has no, that part of us that is inside the heart of us, that has no beginning and it has no end and it loves unconditionally, especially who we are. All right. Okay. All right. Moving right along. The thought massage for today. And you know how we do before we go out and entertain and embrace and engage the thoughts of others. We take the time to entertain, embrace and engage the beautiful thoughts of our own. And we do this with the tap into self recovery reflection, which is you are the treasure. The map is within and love is the compass, and that compass is going straight to the heart, uh, straight to the chest, which is where our heart um, is, is around and abound, and inside of our heart, that part, oh yes, that part of us that is within the heart of us, which is all-knowing, and it is the pearls, the pearls, the beautiful pearls of wisdom. And today, the thought massage is... How would your ideal day flow? So essentially the first thing, the first thing that you think, how would your ideal day flow? flow. The first thing I thought was flow. And my thought was ideally just going with the flow. Going with the flow, knowing that everything is in divine order. And at the end of the day, at the end of the day, the destination is in my favor and along the way. That's my ideal day. Not thinking about, not just going with the flow. All right? <laughs> what is your idea? How would your ideal flow? You might think of the word ideal. You might think of the word flow. For me, the first thing I thought of was that flow, that water, that non-resistant, that powerful, powerful essence of water that is so powerful because it is non-resistant. It don't fight nothing. <laughs> All right. Okay. The next thing is, um, you know how the uh, thought massage, the tap into you thought massage reflection and key. And if you can, if you can, take a moment with me. And I'm loving, um, you see, I have the earrings for, for Valentine's Day. Have the red and the pink. Have some red here on. And I just wanted something big. I love, I like big earrings and the red lipstick. All right, to represent beautiful, beautiful Valentine's Day and the infinity of Not just here in our true self, connecting with that part of me that is inside the heart of me, yet lastingly, lastingly knowing, not just, not just here, more so here, that yes, we are worthy. Yes, we have absolutely all it takes. And yes, we deserve. All right. Okay. So if you can take three nice gentle breaths with me inside, inhale and exhale, inhale through your nose, exhale through your mouth. And as we inhale three times, we're inhaling all the goodness and fullness, grace and favor of the universe. And as we let go, as we exhale through our mouth, we are exhaling all that. And it is going in Infinity into the stratosphere when it's no longer a part of us because we have outgrown the source of whatever has been holding us back. We are outgrowing all that that is not conducive to us, for us. We have outgrown. We are outgrowing because we are tapping into, I love that, thank you. We are tapping into the part of us that is inside the heart of us. We do enough with our head. We do enough with our head mind. We do enough with our minds, the positive thinking, the, this, the stinking thinking, the planning and the goals and this. The part of us that is inside the heart of us knows everything anyway. Let's tap into it, okay? All right, now, let me, uh, all right, let's go. We're going to take one breath, deep breath and exhale gently. Feeling yourself relax, release, renew. Mm. <laughs> Exhale. Okay. Oh, I 
just got a happy Valentine's Day message. Life is beautiful, and people in it are beautiful. So are you. I'm so glad you're connecting with me this morning. I love you. And I wish everything you wish, I wish, I wish for you. And for this, and for this, we give thanks. We move out the way to let it be so. And so it is. All right. What is the thought massage for today? Oh, again, what were we talking about? Tapping to you, the part of you, the heart of you, the this, that, and the other. All right. And this one, this one has just been read recently, too. All right. When your wheels are spinning smoothly, just like Ruppel Stillskin, who spun straw into gold, your ideas are spun into gold. And, 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 and really, when we talk about the tapping into the heart of you, it is all-knowing, yet it's pure innocence, uh, like a child. When Yeshua says, you can enter the kingdom as a child. The kingdom is in here. And I do believe, I believe, just like the Egyptians, yeah, I believe that that message, seek ye first the kingdom, look for the kingdom, um, and the kingdom is within you. The kingdom is in your heart. And your heart tap into you. And those ideas who spun ideas. In, we can spun ideas into gold. Ideas are our children. Ideas are, those are the, 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 the ideas, the thoughts that we have that come, that come from the universe, that come from the creator, that come from God, that we are to express in our own unique way. But the ideas are our children that we nurture, we embrace, we raise to let them grow. So today, the key, the reflection, when your wheels are spinning smoothly, just like Rumpel Stillskin, who spun straw into gold, your children, your ideas, your creativity is spun into gold. When your wheels are spinning, when you're tuned in with the vibe, Oh, yeah. And the key is you, your own universe. Mm, tap into it. All right. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me this morning as we share the thought massage, the vibe, the reflection, and the key. The journey is beautiful, and so are you. Tap into you. Mwah. Again, happy Valentine's Day. I love you as my granddaughter does. See you later.